if police officers want to be treated like professionals, they're going to need to act like professionals. It really is that simple. Civil rights groups across the Bay Area are raising concerns after documents reveal a series of racist, sexist and homophobic text messages sent by Antioch police officers and supervisors over a period of almost two years. A sample of some of the text messages, Officer Brock Marquardt writes, I'm on my way right now. What are you guys up to? Officer Rombo replies, violating civil rights. This isn't just the Antioch Police Department and today. This is historical. Attorney Carmela Carmano's client, Terion Pugh, was named in one of the reports as being targeted by Antioch Police. She believes, given the number of officers involved, they could be considered a police gang under California law. Government Code 1029 and uh, Penal Code Section 13670. And uh, it seems to me that a lot of what we have uh, meets the definition of a law enforcement gang. I have no problem saying it's a police gang. Renowned Bay Area civil rights attorney John Burris says even though he would categorize the Antioch PD to have acted as a gang, it would still be up to an outside agency to investigate patterns and practices of the department to make that determination. That's a group. Well, that becomes a man of like minds. And to the extent it's un unlawful work, then you consider that to be a gang. However, as uh, enticing as this notion might be, now this is not a gang. It is difficult to argue that the Antioch Police Department has engaged in criminal behavior that would be similar to that of a gang. Greg Woods However, is professor of justice studies at San Jose State University. He says a gang is loosely defined as a group of three or more involved in criminal behavior. He points to other police gangs, such as the Riders Gang in Oakland, where police planted evidence and made up false police reports. Here we don't have that. Here we have text messages illustrating racial animus, and therefore we have at the very least perhaps an interpretation of uh, bias, bigotry, racism. Wood says Antioch PD acted more as a fraternity rather than a law enforcement gang and that it would likely take a class action lawsuit to determine otherwise. In Antioch, Ansar Hassan, ABC 7 News.